do you need here? Ab, what do you need here? Come here as fuck, sir. Sir? Ab. Why? Why come here? Because you wanted my service. What service? Massage. What? Massage. Massage? Your what job? What job? That's what I'm doing. Your what job? I'm a cleaner, but when I'm free, I do massage. Your service massage? Your job massage? I'm a cleaner. When I'm free, I do massage. What do you need? What do you need? Come here, what do you need service? What do you need service here? You called me to, to service you. Back. Hi, hi everyone. It's your girl again here. So welcome to my YouTube channel. If you're new, please consider to subscribe like share comment anything down below there guys this is so sad this goes to all kenyans working or to all ladies working in gulf especially saudi arabia unajua kenya ilikutoa kwenu kwa nini you end up to do such things okay contract ilikushinda you went ahead ukatoka kule nje Yes, utapata pesa mo, but we can eat a makando. I personally najua kuna scarcity of work at the moment for the game boys, but patience pays. Ukiwa tu, tulivu, tulia utapata kazi poa. Hii ni nini? What a shame. Some of these ladies shaming our country sasa upatikane kwa nyumba kama hizi you'll end up kuuliwa in the name of mwarabu amekuwa kesho kitu kibaya ikutendekee utasikia oh kwa nini wasichana wetu wanaoliwa sometimes ladies be careful fanyeni kazi mewapeleka huko ama fanyeni kazi imetuleta middle east Na hii kitu ufanyika sana sana kwa wasichana wenye wataki kazi. You end up going to an Arab house in the name of unadanganywa pesa mob ati ufanye massage. It's not always massage. Hii ni umalaya. And I'm sorry to say this. Ladies be careful. Mapolisi sasa hizi wamegondoa sites mingi many sites yenye mnaeka hizi kazi za ujinga and this is the trick that are use, that they are using niambiwa oh, come tufanye hivi kama unifanyie hivi at the end up una, una, una end up kwa mkono za polisi so this girl umeenda kazi ya massage you've been exposed umetuaibisha umeaibisha country yetu then munalia ti Kenyan government, Kenyan embassy, hazi who? Nana liwambia embassy haifanyi kazi yake. Sasa kitu kama hii embassy, how does it, how does embassy come in between this one? Hmm? How can even a government help such a thing? Ladies, style up. I am not saying all ladies, but these few individuals wanataka pesa za haraka. You'll end up jailed there. Muta end up kufungwa hiyo Saudi na hakuna mtu atawasaidia. This is a total disgrace. Unaibisha nchi yetu. And I think few few months or few weeks ago, 
Mm. Kuna hizi mm. rules zimetolewa Saudi, Saudi za hii umalaya. Unaona na mambo mengine sexual harassment, online communication with prostitution, kuna vitu mingi. Kuna kufungwa na kuna fine kitu kama hii ukifungwa definitely huyu ni kama ameangukia kwa mkono wa serikali ama mkono wa polisi ufungwe there is a fine 6000 hmm? alafu ufungwe mwaka moja then you being deported back what a shame guys whenever you people come to gulf ama ukienda saudi ama uende make sure unajua rules za hiyo country Tama tuweke kando. Sao msichana saa hizi wazazi wake hawata hawatamuona. Hawatajua hata hako kwa jela gani. Even the government itself, even the embassy itself haiwezi saidia. Hmm? Ame ukianguka kwa, kwa mkono ya nini polisi then watadil na wewe venye hadi venye utamaliza kifungu chako ama venye yani anything can happen from now. Uvuliwe nguo. You've got parents. Respect yourself, guys. I personally am so embarrassed. Nyaibu. And guys, make sure unasoma rules. Whenever whenever you go to these Gulf countries, make sure una understand rules. Zao. Make sure you have this patient. Musikwe na tama. Huku nje ukitoka ushale unalipwa pesa ya kutosha. Why why do people do this? Shaming our government, shame on you ladies. These few ladies that are doing this. We are not happy. We are not going to even side with this nonsense. Please. Kama umeshindwa na kazi, go back your parents who people still. Yaani bado wanakuhitaji umeaibisha umetuaibisha na sio huyu peke yake this will serve as an example of many who are doing this kuna rules zimetoka i think mtajisomea na mtaona what is going what will happen to this lady so sad watu wafanye kazi hiyo kazi iliwapeleka huko iko na pesa ya kutosha Tama mingi muache. Watu wajitume. Tama hiyezi wasaidia. You break the rules, the government will deal with you. Not Kenyan government, not Kenyan embassy. Saudi government watadil na wewe. And the way these people are inhuman. You guys. Udada mtu muombe to muombe because we don't know what will happen next and for the parents whenever you are ladies come into the middle east please our sjana you have to know kwanza msichana wako ni hard working if she is not don't even send that lady there kama unajua mtoto wako ni rich kid gulf is not for the rich kids Gulf ni kwa wale watu wanajituma rich kids ama watu hawana saiki ya kazi they'll end up doing this Anyway guys subscribe for more thanks for watching and it's so sad Bye for now guys till next time